right. Hello, everyone. Thank you so much for joining. My name is Rachel, and I'm the graduation advisor for West River Academy. And all right. Hello, everyone. Thank you so much for joining. My name is Rachel, and I'm the graduation advisor for West River Academy. We always have to get used to the tech thing since we never do this with a huge group. So thank you for bearing with us. <laughs> okay. And I hope you have lots of friends and family joining us on YouTube. We are now streaming live. Okay. So I wanna welcome the class of 2023. We're so happy to have you all here today. I'm going to make sure everyone is on mute. Here we go. And um, it has been so much fun to work with each person um, who is in our graduation and in the entire program. So I think we'll begin with introducing Peggy Webb. Well, I guess that would be me. So welcome everybody. I'm Peggy Webb. I'm the director of West River Academy, as you all I'm sure know. And I'm so grateful that all of you have decided to join us. And today we are going to honor you, your entire family, because of all the effort that you have all put into your children. And now, especially in the spotlight, will be your star of your family, <laughs> your graduate. And um, it's just a great day for everybody to be able to honor them in this accomplishment. So thank you for coming. Thank you for all of your support um, throughout the time that you've been with us. We know it's not an easy thing to do what you've done. It's taken a lot of courage for each of you, each of your families, to make the decision to do something different. Being different is not a great thing viewed by many people in our, our world. And when you take that path, which is unknown, and many times very scary, especially if you're in countries where you can be persecuted to the degree of being put in prison or having your children taken away from you for doing something like this. It does take a great deal of courage and you are the pioneers in this. And we just can't tell you how much we understand this and value you and appreciate what you've done, not just for your child and your family, but for your community, for your country, for the world, for humanity. This is a great time for all of us to be here on planet Earth. And we have something very special to do. And the first step has been to free our children from this educational system, which is very oppressive. So you have done that. Um, you have shown great courage and we want to acknowledge that. I also would like to talk about trust because you have trusted us and we don't take that lightly. We know it's very difficult to look at a website and then spend a lot of money. We want you to talk to us first to get to know us so you are sure that your decision is what you want it to be, that we are a good fit for you. But then you put out money. And that's trust. You're trusting that we are going to do what we say we do and that your children will have a better life and a better experience in school because of what you have chosen to do. So we, we really, really value and appreciate the trust that you have put in us. <clears throat> and we hope that we have performed to your satisfaction. We do our best and um, we just love what we do. We have a wonderful team, which you're going to meet right now. And um, we're just all behind the graduates. We're always on the same side. It's never the student versus the teacher. You know, it's always, we support the parents who support the child and we're all on the same side. So we just love that. And we love the students realizing that they don't have to fight anymore, that they can release their, their anger and their anxiety and their lack of confidence and they can just move forward looking for themselves. Who are you? Who do you want to be in life? Let us help you. So it's, it's a big deal. And we're just really happy that you have all taken this step. And now 
we trust you <laughs> to go forward with your credentials, with your diploma, with your maturity that you have achieved right now at the end of, of your um, high school career and go forward into the world and bless your community and bless your country and bless your humanity. We trust you to do that because you're the, you're the youngest, you're the newest generation of leaders, of pioneers, and you have a big job to do, you know, <laughs> no question about it. It's not an easy thing to choose to be in this world right now, but we are turning the tide. We have a great future to look forward to because we, you are the creators of this new reality of this new world. And we're going to do it together. And we're so glad that you are a generation of students who have been freed from the system because you know what it's like to be free to some degree and you can lead others. So go forward. Now to get to the ceremony, um, we have now uh, 190 graduates that are graduating this May. We have 54 of you who are today deciding to be with us. And you represent 17 countries altogether. Um, not as many of you are here today, but the total number of countries that are represented with our graduate students are 17. And the countries are Argentina, Australia, Costa Rica, Czech Republic, Ecuador, El Salvador, Hungary, Italy, Japan, Mexico, Portugal, Romania, Slovenia, Spain, South Africa, United Arab Emirates, and the United States. So we are truly international. <laughs> you get the picture. And um, we are now going to go forward with the ceremony. First, we'll introduce the rest of our team. And we'll start with our registrar, Stacy Nishikawa. Hi, everybody. Good to see you all. I'm very excited to be here. Um, my name is Stacy. I am the administrative director. So if any of you have had questions or needed help with your enrollments, your orders, your transcripts, um, I have probably worked with you. So it is great to put a face to a lot of the names that I'm recognizing. And it's very exciting that we have so many graduates this year. Um, I am very excited for all of you to be introduced for all of your hard work and cannot wait to hear where life takes you. So excited to be here. Um, and then I think up next, sorry, Rachel, is it um, Danielle? And Danielle Reiner is our transcript advisor and also works with our graduates. Hi, guys. Uh, my name is Danielle. Um, like Stacy said, I am the transcript advisor. So I have worked with most of you guys to help create your guys' final transcripts that you guys um, go on to use for many different purposes. Um, it's been really great working with you guys and seeing what you guys have all accomplished over the years um, and turning that into a transcript that you can then use. Um, congratulations to all of you guys. I'm excited to finally see your faces and um, I'm excited to hear what you guys have in store. Congratulations, guys. All right, and then I think the next team member we have is Milagros. Milagros, she represents our graduation program in Latin America. Yes, hi, my name is Milagros. I'm a group administrators coordinators uh, for West River Academy. I help in them uh, in every step that they have to follow, enroll students, ask the transcript, and guiding them till the graduation programs. And also I help them, uh, them with uh, everything that they need, exchanging emails and meeting in every time that they need to meet me and ask me things. And also I am a graduation program supervisor in Spanish. I'm very happy and proud to be here uh, sharing with you this amazing moment. Um, I'm very happy that you are part of this freedom in West River Academy. I'm seeing you, I'm seeing the future, and also a big garden full of different types of beautiful and happy flowers. Congratulations. Thank you, Millie. 
And next we will have um, Roger, who is actually the newest member of our team. He um, is Millie's husband. So Roger, you want to introduce yourself? Hi, good morning. My name is Roger. I am an administrative assistant in the Groves admin sector, and I have in West River Academy correcting and transferring transcript, one grade or multi grades, checking that every student is enrolled well, also that the payments are correct, and all this that is needed behind the scenes for working with Millie, my my wife. <laughs> in addition, that I perform IT task and I take care of cybersecurity was River Academy. I'm very happy to be here sharing with you, sharing with you this unique moment. Congratulations from 2023. Thanks very much. Thank you, Roger. Gracias. Wow, he is just learning English now. So that was beautiful. Um, then the next person we have up is Mara. She's also in Latin America. Mara, can you introduce yourself? No, sorry, I was late because my Wi-Fi was dead, sorry. Um, but hopefully I, I could manage to be here. Well, I, I work with uh, Spanish speaking families uh, who are enrolled individually in the academy and I help them with the, the, their problems, the, the things that they need, and also with potential new families. Eh, as well. So I'm really happy to be here and bienvenidos graduados con algunos hemos hablado en español en estos meses. Así que bienvenidos acá. Thank you, Mara. Yeah, so this ceremony will be about half of our students are in Latin America. So this is actually the biggest ceremony that we've had. There are 54 students and in previous years we had about 25 who wanted to participate. So um, the academy is growing and growing and I'm so happy to see that students really want to be a part of the community and meet each other. Um, I wonder why. Um, um, you guys see me? <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, I see you. Okay. <clears throat> um, we actually have a few other team members who couldn't be here today. One of them is Raylan Schaefer, and she is Stacy's assistant, administrative assistant. She helps with a lot of the uh, record request processing and just additional admin work that we have as our academy has been growing. So has our paperwork. So <laughs> thank you so much for bearing with us all as we try to get to you as fast as we can. And we've been growing our team so that we can support all of you quicker and better. Um, and then we also have Monica. She's in Latin America. And uh, she can't make it today, but she's actually helping me with some of the social media management in Latin America um, to grow our Spanish presence there. So, and then once again, my name is Rachel Nishikawa and I'm the graduation advisor. I also am the creative director. So I work on our website, blog and our community. So that is like our social media. Um, as well as some of these tech things. So, you know, this is fun. Hosting and talking is a, is a, <laughs> is a little difficult, so bear with me. Um, <laughs> so I will tell you a little bit about our graduation program. So each year we ask that students present their educational journey in the form of an educational biography. And then two years ago, we introduced the custom project idea. Um, this is so that students can use their creativity to tell the story of their life because we love to see how each student chooses to make each project their own. Now, once the project is accepted, they receive their high school diploma and work with Danielle to finalize their high school transcripts. So today you'll see that each slide for each graduate is different and that's on purpose. We want to highlight the uniqueness and diversity of each student. Um, so we ask them to present a bio. So it talks a little bit about them. And then there's also a testimonial where they just share what their experience in West River Academy was like. So once each student is presented, I'll call on their family to make any comments they would like and congratulate their graduate. 
And then after each graduate, it would be great if we could unmute ourselves and then we can just clap and say congratulations. It's just really nice to have excitement after each graduate rather than just chirping silence. So <laughs> thank you all. And I think we can just get right into it. Yeah, keep in mind, there are some tech technical issues sometimes with these uh, screen shares. So thank you guys for your patience. <laughs> so sorry, I had it ready. Did it disappear? <laughs> <clears throat> Okay, I am coming guys. Oh, yeah. Nice, thanks Stace. Okay, so these are all of the students of 2023. And first up is Alexis Breer. So Alexis, um, her older brother actually graduated with us last year and was in our ceremony last year. So their family has been with us for a long time. And uh, she says, I like West River Academy. I like to learn what I want to learn. I like to learn from experiences and I recommend West River Academy family. So Alexis, is your, are you here? And would your family like to say anything? I know she can hear us. Is that you, Paul? <laughs> yeah. Okay. Um, I don't see your screen, but if you keep talking, it might turn to speaker view. <clears throat> okay. Yeah, we're just really proud of her. Yeah. She's, she's learned a lot. Great. Um, if you all want to unmute, maybe we can congratulate Alexis. <laughs> Congratulations. 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 Felicidades. Can you hit the next arrow, Stace? Mm -hmm. oh, thanks. Okay. So up next we have Amelia Guerrero Povea. And she says, um, I started studying with Mentes Briantes group of West River Academy during the 2020 pandemic. And thanks to this program, I had the great opportunity to know myself more and meet many people. This helped me to learn and enjoy my own interests. Thank you for this opportunity. Amelia is from Ecuador. And this is the first time this group has participated in our graduation ceremony. Um, Amelia, are you here? Would you like to say anything? Yeah, I'm here. I'm here. And, and only to say thank you for everything, you know, the opportunity I have in this program is only I can say in this moment is amazing. I think it might be good to say, this is Peggy. I think it might be good to let people know that Mentes Brillantes is one of our groups and not everybody knows about group enrollment, but we enroll many, many groups from all over the world, especially today, South America and Ecuador and Mexico. These are groups of students who have left the system and they've gathered together and there is an administrator for each group. It's sort of like a learning platform or sometimes it's just free learning. It's, it's mentoring students um, who are out of the system and to give them extra security when they leave the system, um, they enroll with us. So they have their confirmation of enrollment to prove to the authorities that they are enrolled in a real school. And the administrator works with Milagros for all of the enrollment and the transcripts and the graduation. So throughout the ceremony, you will see mention of groups such as Mentes Brillantes, just so you know. Thanks. Thank you. 
Okay, Stacey, we can go to the next one. All right, our next student. Congratulations. Student. Yes. <laughs> Yes. Oh, yes. Congratulations. Congratulations. Oh, we to say. Congratulations. Congratulations. <laughs> it's always this yeah. first yeah. Yeah. Congratulations. <laughs> Congratulations. <clears throat> okay, our next student is Ana Paula Cumbicos Penzelosa. She's from Ecuador as well. She says, I enjoy painting, drawing, and cooking. Once I finished high school, I want to study graphic design at a university. At first, I was nervous about this approach to learning, but thanks to West River Academy, I've had the opportunity to meet excellent people, dear friends, and brothers and sisters for all eternity. I'm really grateful to West River Academy for all these years of learning. Ana Paula, congratulations. Would you like to say anything? Yes, um, uh, good afternoon. Uh, thank you very much for the opportunity you gave us, also for meeting new people, and thank you a lot uh, for everything. <laughs> Congratulations, wow. Congratulations. 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 I love it. <laughs> All right, up next we have... Andrea Lorena Turcios Parada. She is from El Salvador. She says, I'm 17 years old and the oldest of three siblings. We all studied at Los Castaños, which has allowed us to be together in different areas. My experience at the end of this journey is that I discovered that my block with math was nothing more than a lack of confidence in myself. At Los Castaños, I've had teachers who have helped me to excel. Thank you to Los Castaños and West River Academy for this opportunity. Oh, that's very sweet. And Andrea, are you here? Yes, hi, good afternoon. Um, I would like to say that I'm really grateful with the opportunity you gave us. I'm really grateful with West River Academy, with my school, with my family and my teachers who I've learned a lot from. So thank you. Thank you, congratulations. Wow, I love your cap and gown and sitting on the couch with the family. It's so fun to see how everyone celebrates. Congratulations. And all the group of Los Castaños from El Salvador, his other group. Oh. Sí. Yo voy a hablar en español porque mi inglés es terrible, entonces no me quiero arriesgar. Está eh, bien. Eh, gracias. Bueno, eh, nosotros eh, en El Salvador somos nueve alumnos, los que estamos acá conectados. Hemos trabajado muy duro eh, y pues Andrea es, es parte de esto y estoy muy orgullosa, como estoy orgullosa de todos los que estamos acá y hemos trabajado con milagros muy, muy de cerca y ha sido una gran experiencia. Muchas gracias. Gracias. Congratulations. <laughs> Congratulations. Yay. And next we have Anthony Raul Ruiz Yepes. He's from Ecuador. He says, during my schooling, I lived in Galapagos, Esmeraldas, Bahia de Caracas, and Guayaquil City. I really enjoyed the learning style at Mentes Brillantes in Ecuador. I want to thank all of my teachers and West River Academy for their patience and help. <laughs> oh, Anthony, are you here? Would you like to say anything in English or Spanish? <laughs> uh, yes, durante mis estudios este, viví en diferentes lugares. Yo cuando estuve estudiando en esta modalidad, les agradezco bastante. Este, por este tiempo que me dieron. La verdad me divertí, me divertí mucho, fue algo nuevo, una experiencia nueva en la que yo pude adquirir. Y, y muchas gracias por esta oportunidad. Ok, Anthony, felicidades. Congratulations. Congratulations. Felicidades. Congratulations. 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 Okay, and up next we have Ariana Sofia Bolaños Baldeon. She is also from Ecuador. She says, I love to learn about history and to draw and paint in different styles and techniques. My favorite sport is basketball and javelin throw. 
I'm a very optimistic, joyful, responsible, and caring person. I recently took an interest in the art of tattooing because it combines art, creativity, and history. I did homeschooling the last three years of high school, and it was the most excellent way to learn because I could focus on my favorite subjects and learn at my own pace. By doing homeschooling, I learned to be more responsible, organized, and independent. Wow, that's a great summary. Ariana, are you here? Would you like to say anything? Hi, I'm here. Yep, sure. Yeah, so I'm very grateful for this opportunity that I had to learn by homeschooling because it was a different experience and full of like different ways of, of learning. And like I said, I could, I could it was focus on my favorite subjects and it was amazing. Thank you. Thank you. And Felicidades. Oh, congratulations. 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 Yay, 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 yay. Okay. And up next, we have the Pacific Sands program of West River Academy. And Pacific Sands is for students who would like ongoing one-on-one -on -one assistance. It's in the USA. Uh, Shauna Reiswitz runs the program and uh, she can now introduce the students who are graduating as West River Academy graduates. Shauna, would you like to come on? Yeah, um, thank you so much. It's been so wonderful partnering with West River Academy. I um, started it with many of the same reasons and values that you guys started your program, mostly that I value love, freedom, and play. Those are my, that's kind of my motto. Um, and the high schoolers that have joined me, many come from regular high school and are just looking for another way through, and a few are unschoolers through and through. Um, my graduates this year include, um, I don't believe any of them are here, but Katina is here and she was a 2020 graduate and she's now my assistant. Um, and uh, anyway, so I have Anna Farley who came in and graduated, Benjamin Vassoni, I've had him, he's been enrolled with uh, the Pacific Sands program for four years and he has quite an impressive history, he became a pilot and, um, He's also been big into bodybuilding and nutrition and following the, he kind of follows the, the narrative and then maybe anti-narrative as you will. <laughs> uh, we also have Cheyenne Swart, who's a beautiful horsewoman. It's been, she's really starting her own business and building her business, training horses. We have Cooper Day, who's been thick into musical theater and modeling and acting and, um, he has, uh, he, he's doing, he's graduating and, and excited to, he's working and planning to move out soon. We have Jax Huckle, who's the, uh, in an upcoming band called Rue, R-A-U-E, it's called Rue, and um, that you could find them on YouTube, they're, they're becoming, or on Spotify, they're becoming bigger and bigger, and so it's really actually exciting where his band is going. We have Carissa Alley, who is uh, delightful, has got, been in modeling and has done special effects makeup, like very scary looking special effects makeup. We have Levi Hoffman, who is um, a, an avid, avid reader. He's an amazing kid and has been really super delightful to work with. I've never seen a kid read so many books. And Olivia Valencia, who has been uh, just a, a super delight to work with at 17, is moving uh, many miles away from her home and moving in with uh, some friends in Santa Barbara and going to go to cosmetology school. Uh, Soleil, who's getting her EMT license and, um, and has also traveled and done a lot of yoga over in India and, and gotten her yoga practitioner's license. And lastly, Veronica Santos, who's going on to get a, um, a degree in, um, in, I can't think of the word suddenly, the looking at babies in the womb. <laughs> Anyways, these are just wonderful kids. It's been a great privilege to work with Pacific Sands, uh, with West River Academy, allowing us to partner and get our kids accreditation through this wonderful program. So thank you to all of you guys who help us do that. Thank you, Shauna. 
And congratulations to all 10 graduates of the Pacific Dance Program. Yay. Woo, congratulations. If you're on, if you're on the call now. They're going off to our own graduation ceremony yes. now. <laughs> they have their own ceremony in just a few minutes. So thank you for participating in ours and maybe we'll see you there. Okay. Thank you. Wow, that's so fun to hear about what they're all going on to do. All right, up next, we have Brooklyn Morgan. She's from Connecticut, USA. Uh, she provided a bio in addition to her testimonial, so I'll read that first. She said, my name is Brooklyn Morgan. I'm 16 years old, and I've been homeschooled since I was in the fourth grade. I live in Connecticut, and I have five members of my immediate family. Schooling was one of my greatest experiences. I entered West River Academy in ninth grade, and I feel my sister and I were blessed to be part of West River Academy. Her sister is also in this ceremony. Her, her name starts with an M, so we'll get to her later. <laughs> um, and then her testimonial says, West River Academy gave me the opportunity to believe in myself. Having ADHD and some other challenges, I was told I wasn't going to make it past the fourth grade. However, my mother refuted those claims and taught us at home. I entered West River Academy in ninth grade, and it has been my best experience with school because it allowed me to develop my love for learning. Thank you, West River Academy. Wow, Brooklyn, thank you. Let's see, and I see you both here. Hello, would you like to come on? You have two opportunities to speak, <laughs> now and at the end. <laughs> um, I would like to thank, I would like to thank West River Academy for giving me the opportunity to learn and um, develop love to um, a love for learning. And I, I really appreciate you guys. So thank you. Thank you so much. Nice to see you all. Congratulations, yeah. Brooklyn. Congratulations. Thank you for being part of it. <laughs> all right, up next, Bruno. Bruno Sebastian Carrera Yaguana, he's from Ecuador. I want to thank my family for this opportunity and I'm very happy to have chosen West River Academy because it helped me end my school life without sacrificing my sports dreams. Now I can use my time to do everything I like to do and fulfill my dream of running motocross in Europe. So he has a great picture there, such an action shot. <laughs> Bruno, are you here? Hi. Hello. Uh, uh, I want to thank you to West River Academy for this opportunity. Um, I was able to focus on my sport. Uh, so, yeah, I have an opportunity to study too and focus on the both uh, uh, sport and the uh, school. Thank you so much for joining us. Yeah, it's so fun to see your photos and I wish you the best of luck. So yes. Congratulations. 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 Okay, up next we have Carlos Jose Ariaza Barillas from El Salvador. He says, since I was a child, I have enjoyed sports and music. None of these areas have been difficult to develop because my education promotes the best performance in all aspects of my life. With a more open, diverse, and identity-oriented education, I have been able to enjoy my hobbies and academic challenges. Carlos, are you here? Yes, ma'am. First off, I'd like to thank West River Academy for giving me the opportunity. And second off, I would like to thank um, everyone that's been involved in my academic journey because um, they've also, um, they're also part of the results that have happened in my life. So credit goes to them and to West River as well. I want to thank everyone for this opportunity. Thank you. Thank well, you, Carlos. So you all in your tassels you. and cap and gown. Congratulations. 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 Hey. Congratulations. Congratulations. <laughs> <clears throat> okay next we have chloe ruth anderson she is from romania she says 
Um, my name is Chloe Anderson, and I started to homeschool in the sixth grade. I've been swimming for 10 years now, and homeschool has made it easy to get to training and competitions. I also was able to start a new hobby with horses, which I now want to pursue in my future. I plan on being a missionary using horses as therapy for kids with disabilities, orphans, adopted kids, and Christian summer horse camps. And her testimonial says, I'm grateful that my mother was able to find West River Academy. It has made homeschooling more enjoyable and less stressful and has given me many opportunities to be able to do the things that I actually will use in life. This program is very flexible and has given me opportunities to find new hobbies. Thank you, West River Academy. Thank you, Chloe. Are you here? Would you like to say something? Uh, yes, hi. Uh, so I want to thank West River Academy for all the opportunities that they were able to give me and to thank you for helping make learning very enjoyable. <laughs> Congratulations. Thank you. Congratulations. 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 Thank you for being with us. Good luck. Congratulations. Bye. Yeah. Congratulations. <laughs> okay, next we have Damaris Valverde Carrion. She is from Ecuador. She says, I've been with Mentes Brillantes slash West River Academy since ninth grade. At first, it was difficult to learn online, but then I realized that I had the advantage of studying from home and learned to handle various platforms, and that helped me to cope with important academic issues and to finish high school as well. Thank you to West River Academy for making a diploma with international certification possible. Yes, Namaris, would you like to say anything? Hi, good afternoon, everyone. Thank you very much, West River Academy, for giving me this opportunity to learn today with you. At first, it was difficult because of the new year trouble, but then I got used it. I had a wonderful experience that I will never forget. Once again, thank you so much, West River Academy. <laughs> Thank you, Thank you, Congratulations. Congratulations. Okay, up next we have Daniel Villalobos from California, USA. So in his bio, he says, my name is Daniel and I've been homeschooled from preschool through 12th grade. Currently, I am a part-time employee in the mobile home industry, and I'm certified in first aid and CPR. I'm also training in demolition, site preparation, and install installation of mobile homes. Being a student at West River Academy has permitted me to attain the training skills I have today. I am passionate about building sheds and learning how to use new modern tools. I also enjoy playing the acoustic guitar, music engineering, and recording Christian worship songs on my multi-track mixer. I acknowledge that God has gifted me with all these talents. And then his testimonial says, I would like to take the opportunity to express my gratitude to West River Academy for supporting me and allowing me to achieve my goals. I believe God has plans for me and I'm ready to embark on my new chapter of life. Accomplishing high school has been a very rewarding experience. All right, Daniel, I see you already. Welcome. Would you like to say something? Yes, my name is Daniel. Also want to Tell my mom and my parents, my dad, very thankful for the help. Also, I want to say very happy with West River Academy for the support. Thank you all. <laughs> Congratulations, Congratulations, Daniel. Congratulations. Congratulations. Good job. Yeah. Great time celebrating today. <laughs> Looks like you're going to have a party later. <laughs> Thank you very much to all the uh, the support that you've given us. Um, it's been a blessing to have our son with us homeschooled at home, and we're very happy. Thank you. <laughs> Congratulations. Okay, up next we have Diana Sofia Rodriguez Aguirre. She's from Mexico. Um, her bio says, Diana is a curious and autodidactic girl that loves learning new things about everything, math, science, philosophy, history, and arts. With West River Academy, she was able to pursue and explore even more interests at her own will, a characteristic that has made her immensely happy. 
She even made more friends than when she was at a traditional school, and all the knowledge she acquired while being homeschooled is 100% hers. <laughs> and then her testimonial says, being homeschooled was one of, the, one of the greatest experiences of my life that I will never forget. Perhaps it was not all perfect, but it certainly was a more personalized and a more rewarding method of learning and growing as a young person. There is still a lot to learn, and I love learning. <laughs> Diana, do you have anything you'd like to say? Is she here? There are a lot of people in this room. It's really hard to find. <laughs> uh, so I think we'll go to the next one, but we can say congratulations to Diana. Congratulations, Diana. Congratulations. Congratulations, Diana. Congratulations. congratulations. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, next is Enzo Diria Dubon Alvarenga. He is from El Salvador. He says, during the time that I've been with Los Castaños with the support of West River Academy, I've had many challenges because my greatest passion is exercise and sports. This was difficult to combine with my academic life before. It has not been easy to make a balance, but I've achieved it thanks to the support of my family and the school. I feel satisfied and with a lot of motivation to start new experiences. Thank you, Enzo. I think a lot uh, of people are late. Hello, are you here? Hi, good afternoon. I am in I live in El Salvador. I am very proud about what I've been doing these years in school. Uh, I am 19 years old. I am grateful to my family for West River Academy and Los Castaños for supporting me all these years and time in school. Uh, thank you very much to all. <laughs> Congratulations, Enzo. Congratulations, Enzo. Congratulations. Thank you for being with us. Good luck. Um, Congratulations. Yeah. <laughs> Love the enthusiasm. All right. Okay, up next, we have Esperanza Pearson. She's from Colorado, USA. She says um, in her bio, my name is Esperanza. I'm from Denver, Colorado. I'm so excited to share my experiences and joys with everyone. And her testimonial says, this experience has taught me patience, endurance, and to say yes to new experiences, even when you're nervous. I've realized that I have a love for things I didn't know I had before. Mm -hmm. Amazing. Esperanza, are you here? Would you like to say hello? Yes. Hi. Um, thank you so much to West Academy for giving me, um, West River Academy for giving me this experience. Um, I've been able to focus on my music and going to school for getting my trade and focus on other things and find new hobbies and etc. So thank you. Congratulations. 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 Yay. Congratulations. Good job, Excellence. Congratulations. 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 Colorado. <laughs> <laughs> Shout out. <laughs> Okay, up next we have Francis Hoopsie Clancy uh, from Colorado. He says, Westover Academy allowed me to do it my way. It was more engaging to make my own hours in my studies and ski six days per week on Team Summit Ski Academy program. This kind of schooling kept me sane. Now I'm taking my love of skiing further. I'm not just a ski bum. I'll go to college and major in ski resort engineering, lift report and, re and resort management. I'm grateful to be able to turn my passion into my career. Awesome. I'm very grateful for this opportunity and this great experience I've had with this amazing program. And I thank all of you for your time and support. <laughs> Congratulations, Francis. Thank you so much. Congratulations. Congratulations. Good job. We'll see you on the slope. Congratulate my grandson. Congratulations. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Hi, Grandma. Hi, Francis. Congratulations. Francis in New York City. <laughs> ah. Thank you again, Peggy, and thank you again, ladies, for all the support for the last four years. We really, we wouldn't, we wouldn't be here today. So thank you so much. Thank you. You're so welcome. Great to have you guys. Thank you for your support. Next, we have Isabella Arefi. She's from California. She says, one thing I love about Westover Academy is the people I've met through it. The classes allow me to express my creative interests and bring the knowledge I have of those topics into class. 
Before coming here, if you told me that this school had video games used in the classes or a YouTube boot camp, I wouldn't have believed you. But that makes me even more grateful that I came here. Thank you, West River Academy, for the best year ever. Oh, very sweet. She's referring to Cubrio, which is <laughs> a partner that we have. So FYI. Um, Isabella, are you here? <laughs> Oh, hi, Adela, <laughs> nice to meet you. <laughs> um, well, coming here was probably one of the best things i done because before I'd been to three other high schools in like the span of four years. Uh, it's honestly, I, I didn't think I'd get this far. <laughs> But I'm glad I did, and I met so many wonderful friends. I almost lost hope in the education system before coming here, and I'm glad it turned out well. Thank you. And you're still able to be an actress. And yeah. I'm still able to be an actress that soon you gave me the opportunity to go to film festivals and uh, helped me meet my best friend in real life, and my teacher, and everything. We just thank y'all. That's what she said. Mm -hmm. Money Calendar. <laughs> Congratulations. Congratulations, Bella. Good job. You did it. Yay. See you in films. Thank you. <laughs> All right. Up next, we have Jeremy Zambrano. He is from Ecuador. <clears throat> he said, uh, I'm Jeremy Matias Zambrano. I live with my parents and two sisters. I'm 17 and I'm the middle child. My family is from El Trunifo, Goyas, Ecuador. I started West River Academy in 2020 and this allowed me to obtain a more academically advanced level. I dream of continuing my higher education in order to get my college degree in the near future. And then his testimonial. I really liked being able to experience West River Academy. It was very difficult for me to understand some subjects at my previous school. Now I dominate many subjects very well, and I'm happy to share this modality with my friends in hopes that they will have the same freedom. Well, very nice. Jeremy, are you here? Yes, I'm here. Hello. Hello. Hi, I'm Jeremy. I want to say that I am very excited to be here. I'm very grateful for this opportunity to study in West River Academy. So I enjoyed it very much for this opportunity. Thanks. <laughs> Congratulations. 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 Okay, up next we have Yocabed Eunice Gutierrez Morales. She is from Ecuador. Her bio says, I was born in the city of Bahia de Caracas in the province of Manabi, which is well known for its delicious food and the hospitality for, of its residents. Then my family moved to Quito, the capital of Ecuador. Now I live in the city of Guayaquil. My parents are dedicated to theological teaching and this characteristic has led me in a very natural way to be a girl who asks questions and seeks answers. Oh. Testimonial says, for me, homeschool has been a beautiful experience in which I have grown in my studies, and at the same time, I've had time to dedicate myself to doing other things that I like, such as dancing. It also gave me time for myself to start a personal journey to identify my passions and goals. Wow, Yokabed, are you here? Hi. Hello. <laughs> um, it was a great experience for me to learn in this way with West River Academy. I was able to dedicate time to something that I love, which is dancing, and being able to participate in all dance competitions. And with all my heart, thank you very much. Congratulations. 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 <laughs> Next is Jose David Jimenez Morales. He is from El Salvador. He says, I'm 18 years old and I have five siblings, including Sarah, who is also my classmate at school. I've also lived through many challenges at the educational level. And it is in the last few years that I have achieved academic and personal stability with interpersonal relationships that leave me with fond memories. I thank Los Castaños and West River Academy for the opportunity to balance my time and to be able to enjoy my studies and my hobbies at the same time. All right, Jose, would you like to say anything? Yeah, I would like to thank 
my family, Lord Castan, Jose, and West Korea family for this opportunity. Thank you all. Thank you, Beth. <laughs> Congratulations, Jose. Congratulations, Jose. Congratulations. Good job. Yay. <laughs> Okay, next we have Jose Domig from Argentina. His bio says, Jose was born in Salem, Massachusetts and he grew up in the United States, Argentina and Tulum and the Mexican Caribbean. Coming from a bilingual and multicultural background, he's been traveling and living in many countries since he was six weeks old. Jose has followed his interests such as basketball, soccer, taekwondo, tennis, carpentry, reading, music, magic, photography, and robotics. He created a robot that folds clothes with the press of a button. He's a big fan of water sports, especially skimboarding and surfing. He has family members from Argentina and the Dominican Republic and has created bonds with friends and teachers in five continents. Then his testimonial says, West River Academy has supported me to pursue my interests and travel around the world. It was an amazing opportunity to learn from people from different cultures as I continued my education in a self-directed way during the high school years. Wow, Jose, so nice to celebrate you and see you. Do you wanna come on camera? Hi, hello. Um, so first of all, I would uh, love to thank uh, West River Academy and my family for supporting me all these years uh, during my travels and different sports I've been playing. Um, and so yeah, it's been a it's been a great few years with you guys, and I just hope to do uh, to be able to share this experience with you. Congratulations, Thank Thank Jose. Congratulations, Congratulations, Jose. Congratulations, Jose. Good, Good luck with your future. <laughs> Okay, next we have Juan Manuel Gomez Pena. He's from Mexico. He says, my name is Juan Manuel Gomez Pena. I'm very grateful for the great opportunity that Westover Academy has given me. It has opened many doors for me to know myself better, to be able to identify the things I like and to discover my hidden talents. Juan, are you here? Yes, here I am. <laughs> Hello. Hello. Well, I just want to thank West River and my group, Seco Academy, for all the support to my to my parents, for all the support they gave me and my teachers and all, because I'm so happy for with this decision that, that is the homeschool for all the things uh, it gave, gives to me. <laughs> Congratulations, Juan. Congratulations, Juan. <laughs> Congratulations. Good job. Congratulations. Congratulations. Felicidades. <laughs> Congratulations. <laughs> Yay. <clears throat> okay, next is Julio Patricio Palacios Perez from Ecuador. When I entered West River Academy, I learned that education was something different. You reason, analyze, and meditate on how situations are. I like this approach very much. It makes the subjects understandable and interesting. This way of studying makes you responsible for your actions. I love the methodology that West River Academy has. Julio, are you here? Uh, hi, my name is Veronica. I am mom uh, of uh, Patricio. Um, congratulations to Patricio and uh, thanks uh, to you for uh, supporting us. Uh, Blessings. Thank you very much. <laughs> Congratulations. Congratulations. Congratulations, Julio. Good job. Thank you. Bravo, bravo. Um, yo soy el father de my uh, Patricio. Sí. Uh, quiero agradecerles de manera especial por todo este tiempo, por su trabajo. Que el Señor les bendiga de manera muy especial. Y sigan adelante con esta escuela que ha sido una gran bendición para muchas personas alrededor del mundo. Que el Señor les siga dando esa entrega y ese deseo de seguir ayudando a muchos jóvenes para que puedan graduarse y pues ser unas personas que se sirvan a la sociedad, pero sobre todo con principios y valores cristianos. Que Dios les bendiga. Thank you very much. Muy amable. Very nice. Gracias. Gracias. OK, 
Okay, next we have Calden. He says, um, West River Academy gave me the time and ability to work at my own pace and focus on what's important to me. Over the years, I have learned about subjects through real life experiences, courses, and self-directed research. In addition to the general school curriculum, I've learned to design and code video games, race my mountain bike at an elite level, learn Spanish in another country, teach mountain biking to kids, and play my guitar. And he oh. is from Oregon, USA. <laughs> okay. Hello, Calden, are you here? Yeah, I'm here. <laughs> um, I'd just like to say thank you to West River Academy and my family for these opportunities that I've had. Yeah, you've had an amazing life, I, yeah. <laughs> read all about it and he has been all around the world it's so fun to see all the diverse things our students do so uh, i'm so happy we can celebrate you yeah, congratulations congratulations Colvin. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> congratulations thank you <laughs> up next is levi saven um, his bio says, because of the freedom that homeschooling has allowed me, I've explored many hobbies that I otherwise would not be able to explore in public school. I've been able to hone my skill in snowboarding, take frequent trips up to Tahoe whenever the weather's nice. I've taken drum lessons every week for many years and love music, even forming a band with some friends. Most importantly, I've been able to get an early start on my future career, taking several classes that will get me on track towards becoming a firefighter. His testimonial says, thanks to West River Academy, I've been able to explore different subjects and pursue my own interests while keeping track of my education. I'm so grateful that my family and I chose this program for our unschooling journey. Congratulations, Levi. Would you like to say something? Yeah, I just want to say um, I'm very grateful that my parents took me out of public school and put me into unschooling and took the time out of their day to help me learn um it's been it's been really good it's given me a great kind of balance between my education and then also doing the things that I want to do um so I'm just glad for the opportunities that I've had because I probably wouldn't have them if I was still in public school so yeah awesome congratulations right. congratulations Levi, Levi. good job congratulations, congratulations, Levi. congratulations. congratulations. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Okay, up next we have Macy, Macy Morgan. Um, her bio says, I've been homeschooled since the second grade at age six. I live in Bloomfield, Connecticut. I have two siblings and two dogs. I love them very much. I also love traveling and eating different ethnic foods. And her testimonial says, West River Academy has helped me use the world as a classroom without boundaries. It allowed me to visit different states, countries, and museums, and I was able to pursue different interests like pet care, knitting, cooking, and IT, while also completing college courses at an early age. I feel privileged to have had the opportunity to be a part of what. Thank you for this opportunity. Hi, Macy. Would you like to say anything? Hi, sure. Um, I'm so thankful to West River Academy to be able to have this opportunity to graduate at the age of 14 and to be able to start college courses with my sister. And my dad wants to say something. My wife and I would just like to thank West River for the wonderful uh, learning program that you guys have put in place to assist um, our daughters in learning at their own pace. And uh, we truly feel that by them learning at their own pace, they're going to prosper in life a lot better and they're going to remember a lot of the things that they've learned. So we're very proud of them and we look forward to their great success in the future. So thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Awesome. Congratulations. Congratulations. Thank you. Good luck in college. Okay, up next we have Malachi Davison. She is currently living in Abu Dhabi right now. Her bio says, I'm 17 years old. And I was born in Australia, and I've been traveling the world with my mom, dad, and older sister since I was four years old. My educational journey has been filled with adventures, challenges, and lots of unique experiences. My journey so far has given me the confidence to know I can try just about anything that looks interesting to me. And that has resulted in some amazing experiences, like building an engine, competing in a NASA hackathon, 
rewiring the lighting in my house, developing a robotics prototype, and teaching at my local theater group. And then her uh, testimonial says, since starting this chapter of my educational journey with West River Academy, I've been able to discover and explore my interests in more depth, learn the way that's best for me and open doors I didn't realize were available to me. Homeschooling with West River has breathed a life back into my education that traditional schooling sucked out and I couldn't be more grateful. Thank you, WRA. <laughs> Malachi, are you here? Yeah, I'm here. Um, I just want to say thank you to West River Academy for allowing me to learn the way that I was meant to learn and for, you know, providing me for the, with this opportunity. And I want to say thank you to my uh, family and my parents for uh, allowing me to do this and uh, sacrificing so that I could do what was best for me. We're super proud of her and we're really grateful for the opportunity. So thank you very much. Thank you. Oh, congratulations, Malachi. Congratulations. 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 Oh, my God. I love seeing everyone's uh, decorations. Oh, the banners, everybody's decorations. <laughs> yes, congratulations. Wow. Okay, let's see. Next, we have uh, Maria Fernanda Ariasa Barrias from El Salvador. She says, my name is Maria Fernanda Ariasa. My educational experience so far is very satisfactory because my educators have made every effort to highlight my intellectual abilities and my hobbies. I've had the opportunity to achieve an apprenticeship in science and I've developed my skills in gymnastics and cooking, which is something I always wanted. Mm -hmm. uh, Maria, are you here? Yes. Um, yeah, I would like to start uh, by saying that I'm um, I appreciate all the well, Escuela Castaños and the teachers, everything they've done for me. They've taught me and for the opportunity in order for me to develop in other areas of my life. And I'm very thankful for West River Academy for also giving me the opportunity to graduate. So yeah, thank you. Nice, congratulations. Congratulations, Maria. Good job. Congratulations. Yay. Congratulations. Yay. congratulations. Okay, up next we have Maria Nicole Kerink from El Salvador. I've always enjoyed facing any challenge. In my school life, I've had many. At Los Castaños, with the support of West River Academy, I have learned that intellect, academic performance, human sense, social sensitivity, and emotional intelligence are just as important. I feel very satisfied with my achievements and I'm eager to start a new stage in my life. Oh, very exciting. Maria, are you here? Yes, um, first of all, I wanna thank my family that's behind me, um, West River and my school for always believing in me even when nobody else did. Uh, it is truly an honor to be able to be here and I wanna congratulate everyone on this incredible milestone. Thank you. Congratulations. Congratulations, Maria Nicole. <laughs> Congratulations. Good, yes. Yes. Good, yes. Good luck. Exciting. <laughs> Okay, Maria Paula Peraño, she is from Ecuador. She says, my name is Paula Peraño Barriga and I was born on November 23rd, 2005 in Quito, Ecuador. Since I was a child, I have been attracted to the artistic field, especially music, drawing, and later on literature and cinema. When I was 11 years old, I recorded my first album, Viaje Sin Fin. I was also invited to several music festivals in this country. I have also made four short films of my authorship. Uh, Paula, are you here? Yes, uh, hello everyone. Um, thank you very much with all the people who have been part of my learning, my family, my friends, and my teacher, and West River Academy for allowing me to study freely. Congratulations to all. Congratulations. 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 Thank you, Maria. Paula. Congratulations. Yay, congratulations. And maybe, uh, Millie, can you explain maybe the, um, some names have a Maria at the front and like, that's kind of normal, right? In Latin America, some names you put Maria at the front, but you call them by the second name. Yes, that's very normal. Sometimes also, for example, Juan, for uh, for example, Juan, Jose, Juan, Pablo, it's like John Paul. 
is uh, and and maybe Mary also Mary, Mary uh, Maria Paula or Paula example. no is Maria Paula it's only Paula it's only Paula <laughs> oh. no. Ah, oh, Paula. Thank you. Okay. Rick was wrong. That's why I was like, why did it say Maria? Okay. Well, I apologize for that. Sorry. Um, <laughs> but it's very normal. Okay. <laughs> Could happen. Okay. <clears throat> okay. Up next, we have Mateo Nicolas Carsco Chukimarca. He says, I was born in 2006 in Ecuador. Since a young age, I have always been interested to discover more of what surrounds me. In the course of my studies, I have had a preference for science and mathematics, as I found them more interesting and easier to understand than other subjects. During these years, I also took part in various math competitions, poetry declamations, French contests, and extracurricular activities such as volleyball, model UN, and scouts. Currently, I am being part of the Rotary Exchange Program, doing an exchange year in Switzerland. Wow. He says, I would really like to thank my parents and teachers who during the first formative period have helped and encouraged me to achieve my goals and acquire a wide variety of knowledge. This process wouldn't have been so interesting and funny without the accompaniment of friends to whom I would like to give thanks as well. I also thank my brother and sister for their help on all occasions. Mateo, would you like to say anything? Hey everyone, um, I'm glad to be here and yeah, thank to my parents. I'm thanked to my parents because they came up with the idea of doing homeschooling while I'm doing this exchange here. And yeah, congrats to everyone. And thank you, West River Academy, for this opportunity. Congratulations. Congratulations. Okay, up next we have Michael Donahue. Michael lives in Oklahoma and has become a traveler. He enjoys learning about new places and meeting new people. He loves learning about historical world events and staying up to date on what's happening around the world. Michael has strong family ties and keeps in touch with his cousins, aunts, and uncles through the nation on weekly Zoom calls. And his testimonial says, West River allowed me to customize my learning so that I could take advantage of my skills. I've always done well on computers and my ability to gather information from online sources helped me to excel in this program. It also allowed me to travel and increase my independence to prepare me for my future. Thank you. Thanks, Michael. Are you here? Yeah, I'm here. Yes. I, <laughs> I just wanted to thank West River for this opportunity of homeschooling. It's just been such an amazing journey. Aww. Thank you so much. I, I, I really was grateful that you worked with us as we um, were moving during high school right after uh, the COVID um, era and you just really helped us. <laughs> That's awesome. Right. Congratulations, Michael. Thank you. Congratulations. Congratulations. Yay. Wow. Oh, it's so good. Everyone. Aww. <laughs> Okay, next we have Nahum Aguilar Pacheco. He says, I've had the opportunity to experience education in traditional schools where I've learned things that I do not forget. However, my experience in the education offered by Los Castaños and thanks to the support of West River Academy, my idea of education took an important turn. I love music and I'm currently a member of the school band. I finished my school life with a lot of enthusiasm and desire to live new stages. Nahum, are you here? Yeah, hi. Um, I just want to thank Los Castaños for everything they've done to support me. And I also want to thank West River Academy, who have continually supported us throughout my uh, educational career. It's been great being this time in this school. Awesome. Congratulations. 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 Good job. Good job. Congratulations. Congratulations. Yay. Yay. No. <laughs> <laughs> okay, now we have Nicole Amelia Ochoa Palacios from Ecuador. She says, my experience in homeschooling has been challenging, but also enriching. It has taught me valuable skills and allowed me to explore my interests more deeply. 
I'm excited about the opportunities ahead, and I'm sure that my experience in homeschooling has prepared me well for any challenges that may arise in my path. Although the transition to homeschooling was challenging at first, I'm grateful for this experience because it has allowed me to grow as a student and as a person. It has taught me to be more autonomous, responsible, and disciplined, skills that I know will serve me well in my academic and professional life in the future. Thank you for giving a different and fun opportunity of study to young people like me. Nicole, wow. Love, she has pictures of her paintings too. Are you here? Yes, hi, good afternoon. Uh, thank you for this opportunity and creating this comfortable way of study. I enjoy being able to organize my time and able to do my all my hobbies. So I'm here painting and handmade jewelry. Thank you. Yay. Congratulations, Congratulations Nicole. Nicole. Good job. Yay. Yay. Congratulations. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> Oh, have fun celebrating today. I love it. <laughs> okay. And yeah. Nimrod Kiss from yeah. Romania. What's that? Like he says, my parents enrolled me in West River Academy in the second semester of fifth grade. <clears throat> Being an individual with a unique perspective of life, I've always looked at the world through a different lens. I enjoy traveling and learning about different cultures, so this non-traditional education was the best choice for me. Homeschooling provided me a safe and supportive environment and a personalized educational experience. Thanks to your school, I was able to experience a peaceful learning habitat, free from distractions and negativity that can be found in traditional schools. I'm very grateful for this. Thank you, West River Academy, for this opportunity. Lastly, I wanna thank my mom and dad. I'm so lucky to have them as my parents, and I'm grateful for everything that they've done for me. Oh, I see you, you are ready. Hello. <laughs> hey. Hello. Yes, would you like to say anything or your family? Uh, yes. I would like to thank, would like to thank uh, my family for uh, everything. And, and and for this important uh, opportunity, opportunity being, a homeschooler. being a homeschooler. Thank you for everything. <laughs> Thank you for joining us. Well, wow. so congratulations. 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 <laughs> Next year, we'll have to learn how to say that in Romanian. <laughs> Every year we add on more countries and... Uh, yeah, I have to learn to speak more than two languages. <laughs> okay, next we have Paula Anahij Jaramillo Ruiz from Ecuador. The last couple of years have shaped me to become the best version of myself. Scary news is you're on your own now. Cool news is you're on your own now. <laughs> Today marks the beginning of the rest of our lives. Today will be one we won't soon forget. Oh. Yeah. Paula, are you here? Yeah, I am here. Can you hear me? I don't know if you can hear me. Yeah, we hear you. Oh, okay. You're a little quiet. Yeah, I'm just very thankful with this opportunity. Um, I'm very excited for the future. And yeah, this has been a wonderful journey, and I'm really, really grateful. Mm -hmm. Aw, well, congratulations. Congratulations, Paula. <laughs> Good job. Congratulations. congratulations. <laughs> Okay, now we have Ricardo Andres Chiriati Hernandez from El Salvador. He says, I am Ricardo Chiriati, and I want to say thank you to Los Castaños and West River Academy. I have been able to spend time on my passions like fishing and motocross. I'm so grateful that I've had the opportunity to study and experience education in a different way. Ricardo, are you here? Hi. Hi. Can I speak Spanish? Yes. Sí. <laughs> eh, yo le digo gracias a mi familia por todo el apoyo que me han dado y a West River Academy a los castaños por todo el ciclo escolar. Gracias. Congratulations, Ricardo. Thank you. Congratulations. Hey, good job. Congratulations. 
Okay, next we have Robert Ariel Tamayo Jimenez. He sent a bio that says, thanks to all the support from my family and friends, I've been able to fulfill some of my dreams during my childhood and adolescence, such as being a singer, musician, and athlete. I love creating moments and cherishing them as a great treasure. In this stage of my life, I want to learn much more, learn from my mistakes, and be successful in everything I set my mind to. I want to never give up. His testimonial says, these past few years at West River Academy have been one of the best experiences of my life. I learned to know myself as a person, to improve myself every day, and all thanks to their practical and innovative method, where they taught me to develop my skills as a student and as a person. Wow. Robert, are you here? Uh, hello to everyone. Can you hear me? Yeah. Uh, I'm so very happy to study in Westboro Academy, and I can be a big person for my parents, my brother, and thank you for uh, this opportunity. Congratulations. Congratulations, Congratulations. Okay, next we have Sarah Jimenez Morales from El Salvador. She says, throughout the time I've experienced alternative education and after having constant changes in different educational spaces, I'm so grateful to Los Castaños and West River Academy. I've been able to prove to myself the great abilities I have. I have spent time with good friends and I have enjo enjoyed my journey to the last step of my school life. Uh, Sarah, are you here? Uh, yes, um, good afternoon to all. Uh, I just want to express my gratitude with you know, the West River, my school, my teachers, and my family, of course, all the support and effort. And yeah, I would like to say they, thank you really, really much for everything. Thank you. Aw, oh, thank you. Congratulations, Congratulations Sarah. Sarah. Good job. Congratulations. 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 Okay, up next we have Savannah Burr. She is from Colorado, USA. She says, I love camping with my family and enjoying the beauty of nature. I like to do aerial silks and the aerial hoop. While I have many hobbies, painting and listening to music are my favorites. I'm so looking forward to my future. Her testimonial says, I started West River Academy in the 10th grade. Prior to that, I was attending a private school using a classical education model and I was struggling. I'm very thankful for West River Academy as I have found so much freedom these past few years. Thank you so much. Thank you, Savannah. Are you here? Okay. Hi. Hello. Thank you guys. <laughs> Looks like you're, you're all congratulations. Out. You're all decked out. <laughs> <laughs> Would your family like to say anything? We just thank you, West River Academy, for the opportunity and the freedom that it's given our family. Congratulations. Awesome. Well, congratulations. congratulations. Good job, Savannah. Good luck. Yeah. Good Okay, next we have Stefan Kursik Nekosea from Romania. He says, I'm glad to be part of this project and equally glad that I ended up in this wonderful education system that is West River Academy. Here, I've been able to learn what interests me and what helps me in life, as opposed to the learning methods of the state educational system. Being able to learn freely and then use that knowledge practically to support myself financially is what education should be about. <laughs> yeah, Stefan, are you here? <laughs> Yes, I'm right here. Hello. Hello. I just want to thank you for this opportunity and uh, for uh, giving me this field where I can actually learn something and use that learn that what I learned for my advantage. And what can I say? I'm just very happy that <laughs> I can be part of this project. <laughs> Yes, we're happy to have you. Thank you so much. Congratulations, Stefan. Good job. Good luck. Congratulations. Thank you. Congratulations. How do we say congratulations in Romanian? Uh, felicitări. 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 Sounds, like, sounds like Spanish. Felicidades. Thank you. Yeah. Felicidades. 
Thank you. Next, we have Tommy Hidalgo Grimbal from Ecuador. He says, I'm very grateful for the opportunity to be a part of West River Academy. It's been an invaluable experience that has allowed me to explore my passions, develop my skills, and learn more about myself. Thanks again for opening the doors to a better education that I enjoyed. Tommy, are you here? Uh, yes, uh, good afternoon to everyone. I'm so grateful for being part of the West River Academy program. It has let me uh, learn what I want to learn. And I'm so grateful for being in this method of studying. So thank you to all and congratulations to everyone. Okay, now we have Victor Yunuel Martinez Orozco from Mexico. He says, I'm so grateful that I've been able to pursue music because of having an education with West River Academy. I was fortunate to be able to study piano at the School of Artistic Initiation associated with the National Institute of Fine Arts. I also like to play bass and guitar. I started to play professionally with my dad and my brother in a group called Blue Note. I would really like to pursue a professional career in music at the University in Monterey or Tampico and become a professional musician. I also like to prepare desserts at home. Ooh. <laughs> okay, Victor, are you here? Yes. Hola. Hi, I'm June Noel. I want to say thank you, Best Weaver Academy, for all your support. Thank you very much. I'm so happy and so nervous. Thank you very <laughs> much and congratulations. Hi. Good job. Congratulations. 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 Thank you. 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 for you. Thank you. Thank you. for you. Thank 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 you. And so let's celebrate. Congratulations, everybody. And thank you very much. Awesome. Thank, thank you. you. Congratulations. Good job. Blue note, go. <laughs> wow. And I think we have made it to our last student, Yomira Lisbeth Brito Sanchez from Ecuador. She says, I'm very grateful to West River Academy for giving me this opportunity to learn in an easy and fun way. It has allowed me to have new opportunities and to be able to fulfill one more dream. Thank you very much. Yomira, are you here? Okay, she had a good, good afternoon for all of you. I am Sonia Martinez from Mente Brillantes. I am the director of the group and we're so happy to be here sharing this uh, great event with you all. Uh, Yomira told me to represent her uh, for this moment because he had, she had an emergency now. Uh, she's so happy and grateful, as she said, here to be part of this um, opportunity, the learning opportunity uh, of a different way. Grateful uh, to Mente Brillantes and the River for the opportunity. And I, as the director, I want to congratulate all of you and especially the students like uh, Anthony, uh, Jamila, Damaris, uh, Ana Paula, Amelia, Jeremy are here from this congratulations to you all. <laughs> Thank you so much for representing her and for letting us see your beautiful face ahead of Mentes Brillantes. Yeah, and thank, and thank for all the groups. All the groups and Los Castaños too, and of course Mente Brillantes and every every group, every admin, which help with all the all, all them hearts to the students to be freedom and happy. Thank you so so much. <laughs> Congratulations, everyone. Yes. Can so, you go to the slides, Stacy? Oh yeah. And then hit it one more time. Yeah. 
So now it's time to certify the graduates. And that's what we do in the United States at the end of the ceremony. So here's the certification. West River Academy is accredited by the National Association for the Legal Support of Alternative Schools, which has approved our high school graduation program. So as the director of West River Academy, I certify that these students, all of you, have met the requirements for graduation from high school and are ready to receive your diplomas. Congratulations. Ladies and gentlemen, may I present to you the graduates of West River Academy's class of 2023. Yay! And if you have tassels, you can tell them. Thank you. 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 Thank you all for coming today, right, for showing up, and for showing up in this world. We have great work to do, and we're all going to do it together. So whatever you're great at, go for it. Be yourself. <laughs> Be true to yourself and do what you love. That's what West River is all about. And we hope you'll go forward and just love yourself and love life. We'll be looking for you. <laughs> Thank, you Thank, Thank you very much. Bye -bye. Bye -bye. Bye. 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 Thank you very much. Bye. 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 Congratulations. Thank you. Gracias. Felicidades a todos. Bye. Muchas gracias. Bye. 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 Bye